everybody and welcome back to All Over Yarn channel. Today we learn how to crochet an easy flower, an easy rose, even for beginners. To begin you have to chain 52 chains. After do this, we skip the first 5 chains, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and into the 6th one, we will do a double crochet. Now chain two, one, two, and to work a double crochet into the next stitch. Now chain two. Skip the two next chains and into the very next work a double crochet. Chain two. Work a double crochet into the very next chain. Now continue the pattern by chaining two, then skipping the two next chains and into the very next work a double crochet. Chain two again and into the next one work a double crochet all across till you reach at the end of this row. Once you are at the end, chain three and turn your work. Work 5 double crochet in this chain of 2 space. The first chain of 3 counts as our first double crochet and we need 5 more. So in total we need 6 double crochet. Now in this space, in the next space of two, in the big gap, work a single crochet. Now continue the pattern by crocheting six double crochet into the small gap here and a single crochet into the next big gap. Continue like this until you have 5 cells in total. We've already made uh, the first one and we need 4 more. Once you have uh, completed your 5 small cells, now we're going to do a little bit bigger cells. So continue with crocheting 9 double crochet into the next space of 2 into the small gap a single crochet into the bigger gap again 9 double crochet into the next one so we need 9 1 2 3 and 9. Work a single crochet into the very next bigger gap and continue this pattern of crocheting 9 double crochet into the small into the next small space and a single crochet into the very next bigger space until you have in total 6 of these bigger cells. Once you have finished with uh, your six bigger cells, you are ready for the biggest one and the last one. So into the next gap here, we we'll have to do 12 double crochet and end the row with a single crochet into the last gap here. So into this last space, we need 12 
double crochet. If you want the written instructions for this pattern, check my description box below. And the last one, 12. And with a single crochet into the last space. And this is all. What you have to do now is to twist your flower like this to give it a shape and with the help of a needle you have to sew uh, you have to sew the flower and this is it so simple and so easy even for the beginners if you like this video please share and like it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for all my new videos see you in my next video bye bye